Well, hello to you, God's people. As we gather together this weekend for worship, we want to welcome you to worship. Whether you are worshiping in person, if you are a guest with us, uh, thanks for being a part of this. We encourage you to go over to our Welcome Center and to uh, take with a gift that is especially for you. If you're worshiping with us online, uh, thanks for joining us. We are so blessed that uh, even from a distance, we can worship together our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ. Uh, this past week, uh, we had the awesome opportunity to celebrate a vacation Bible school. We had children here, we had parents here, families here. And so we, first of all, wanted to say thank you to all the volunteers who made this possible. Thank you for your time, your energy, your excitement, and your passion in sharing the gospel. If uh, you are not able to be a part of vacation Bible school, we want to encourage you there's still a way to participate at our table in the narthex where we have our children's bags for Sunday morning, we actually have some of our virtual VBS bags as well. It includes inside of it the craft, the information on some of the activities along with the CD. And then all of the videos that go with virtual VBS are still on our website. So you can still participate in learning about what we heard about this past week about Jesus, our strong foundation, he who began a good work in us and will bring it to completion in the day of our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ. So we are just so excited to be able to share that message with our children. And again, if you weren't able to participate, encourage you to be able to do that through the virtual VBS materials we have for you. We want to make you, as God's people, aware of some important dates that are coming up in uh, the life of grace, what's going on here. So uh, here are a few of those dates. You'll be able to see those right here uh, on the screen. And uh, the dates include this. August 16th, that Sunday, we're going to do a new member welcome to all of those who have joined us over these past few months. will be a great celebration of welcoming into the family of God new members. August 19th is going to be our last Wednesday night worship service. So August 19th, last Wednesday night worship service. August 23rd, well, we're going to have that weekend uh, on the Sunday services, our teacher rededication. We're going to have ministry anniversary celebrations that we were unable to do in the spring of 2020. And then at right after our 10 o'clock service, you know, we're going to have a town hall meeting in the sanctuary. So we invite you to come hear from some of the leaders at Grace. Uh, we'll talk about ministry that's taken place over these past few months during the season of COVID. And then you'll be able to ask questions. We'll be able to have a conversation as the family of God should. So that's August 23rd, right after 10 o'clock. August 26th, that's a Wednesday night, uh, we'll have a special worship service that is our first communion celebration. We were unable to do that uh, Monday, Thursday this past year, so we're going to be celebrating that first communion celebration for those who went through the communion class on August 26th. August 27th is our first day of school. August 30th, that's a Sunday, we're going to have volunteer training as we get ready to kick off ministries here at Grace. September 13th is going to be our ministry kickoff weekend for Sunday morning children's ministry and youth group and, and many other areas of ministry. Now, I know you may have a lot of questions about the volunteer training, Sunday mornings, Sunday evenings. There is more information that will be coming out to you, but we just want to put these dates on your calendar. September 13th, ministry kickoff. And then October 25th, we're going to celebrate confirmation for those who are uh, unable to celebrate that in May. The last announcement that I have for you this weekend is uh, this was the space right here where we celebrated worship this past weekend. And, and after experiencing that worship in this environment, uh, we as some of the leaders and staff at Grace met together and, and we would like to offer the opportunity for us to gather together in this space, weather permitting, as often as possible during our 10 o'clock worship service. So we are looking for right now some volunteers to help us make that possible. There are things that we have to lift and move and bring out so that we can have the speakers and the praise team and we can worship together in this space. Uh, we would like to start that in a couple weeks, but we're going to need four people who are willing to serve 
on the weekend, starting at 920 for setup and then finishing right after the service with some of the pickup. So if you're willing to be a part of a group that helps to set up and pick up in this space on Sunday mornings just for our 10 o'clock service so that we can worship outside weather permitting, if you would contact Bill Cahill, uh, his email is on the screen right here as well. Uh, he would love for you to be on that team so that we can gather together on a weekly basis at 10 o'clock out here in this space God has provided for us so that together we might hear his word and receive his gifts. As we worship our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ now, we pray that this time would be a blessing to you and your family.